You know, it's a question I think every human being, all right, especially us or as adults should ask ourselves, have I helped change someone else's life for the better, okay, in a positive impact? Guys, I will say this is something that God has instilled in me for a long time. You know, being a giver, always love helping people, always love to help people elevate, help people be in better positions. Uh, because there was a time in my journey I didn't have that. So I know how it feels when you don't have someone that can help you, that can push you, that can lead you, that can help, you know, give you opportunity, right? And I've I, I always, always received such positive feedback. But today, today, man, I received a phone call, all right, from a Facebook um, colleague. And that phone call was so powerful of just someone expressing their gratitude. But also, like, Courtney, you don't realize what you have really done for me. There's no way I can describe this, all right? And guys, again, this is something I've been doing. This is something that I love doing, and this is something that I will continue to do, all right? But as a human being, okay, ask yourself, and I don't care if it's just one person, have I helped change someone else's life for the better? Guys, I will tell you, I'm not going to say I believe it, okay? Maybe, I'm going to say for a fact, I know that's why I'm continue to be blessed. Um, I'm continue to um, have God's favor. Um, I, I, I'm in a position to to give, you know, because I've been given. So, you know, sometimes it's hard to give when you don't have anything to give. But a lot of us do have things to give, but we don't give because we're selfish. Um, we have a lack mindset. We think that someone is going to take from us. You know what I'm saying? And uh, I want to say, man, just just go out here and help somebody. You know, I think that is our main objective. One of our main objectives as a human being is to help somebody. And I will say this. Don't let people take advantage. All right. Because when you have a kind heart, you are a giver. People will try to take advantage. People will try to hit your soft spots. Um, and sometimes when you give, it's like the people that you give the most to, it's like it's never enough. And those are those are what I call takers. Those are people who just like to take. They like to take, you know, and, and, and they're going to take as long as you give. But when it comes to changing somebody's life for the better, and when someone can, can reach out and let you know in such a manner, in such words where it, it, it's just the feeling of the message. It's almost like you don't even hear it. You just feel it. And I will say, man, I, it, it's amazing. It's amazing, guys. It was a great way to end my day, all right? And uh, so change someone else's life, okay? Don't be afraid to give. Don't be afraid to share. Don't be afraid to help, all right? Um, because I'm telling you, it comes back. It comes back 10 times fold, 50 times fold, 100 times, 1,000 times. And it comes back in ways where you would never imagine. And this is why God has given us a memory so we can remember where we come from. We can remember the things that we've done. We can remember our past. And I can speak for myself. Looking where I am now compared to what I was 10 years ago, guys, <laughs> it's amazing. God is good. And like I say, man, I know I'm going to continue to elevate. My family is going to continue to elevate. My, the people around me who's connected to me, they're going to continue to elevate. My finances are going to continue to elevate. My life is going to continue to elevate. My business is going to continue to elevate, all right? But even if it didn't, I'm so grateful to be in the position that I am now because of what I did in the past. And one of those things is helping somebody. So help somebody. It won't hurt you. It will actually help you. And I'm telling you, man, <laughs> life is amazing.